there are several text editors available in Linux to edit files. They are categorized into two parts that are GUI based and screen oriented text editors. VI is a screen oriented text editor originally designed for Unix and Unix based operating systems. VI is the most popular and classic text editor in the Linux family. Below are some reasons which make it a widely used editor. It is available in almost all flavors of Linux distributions. It works the same across different platforms and distributions. It is user friendly. Hence, millions of Linux users love it and use it for their editing needs. In recent times there is an advanced version of the VI editor available, and the most popular one is VIM which is VI improved. Some of the other ones are Elvis, NV, Nano, and Vile. It is wise to learn VI because it is feature rich and offers endless possibilities to edit a file. Before started I hope you have subscribed to my YouTube channel if not subscribe now and also press the bell icon to stay updated with our latest videos. To work on VI editor, you need to understand its operation modes. They can be divided into two main parts. One is command mode and the second one is insert mode. In commands mode VI only understand commands, you can only move the cursor and cut, copy, paste the text. In command, you can modify and change the file. Remember that commands always case sensitive. Insert mode always used to insert text into the file. You can switch to the insert mode from the command mode by pressing I on the keyboard. Once you are in insert mode, any key would be taken as an input for the file on which you are currently working. To return to the command mode and save the changes you have made you need to press the S key. To launch the VI editor open the terminal and type VI and then add your file name. Here I add VI first file. As you see VI editor open in command mode. Always remember that if you specify an existing file, then the editor would open it for you to edit. Else, you can create a new file. Press I to enter the insert mode. Here I type welcome to technoscience. Press S to enter command mode. Press semicolon WQ to save quit. To check the content of the file we use cat the file name here the file name is the first file. VI editing commands there are several commands available in VI text editor. Note that you should be in the command mode to execute these commands. VI editor is case sensitive so make sure you type the commands in the right letter case. Here are all the commands used in VI text editor. Make sure you press the right command otherwise you will end up making undesirable changes to the file. You can also enter the insert mode by pressing A, A, O, as required. Moving within a file. You need to be in the command mode to move within a file. The default keys for navigation are mentioned below else. You can also use the arrow keys on the keyboard. S Saving and closing the file. You should be in the command mode to exit the editor and save changes to the file. I hope in a short of times I have completely described the whole thing. If there are any doubts then write down on my comment session. You can follow me on my Facebook page and my Instagram page. Thanks for watching it.